New at six, we are hearing from a cab driver who had a knife held to his neck after unwittingly becoming the getaway driver in the latest of a string of robberies. Only 13 Action News reporter Tom George spoke with the driver who has a warning for other cabbies and rideshare drivers. As Dennis Donahue drives around town, now a little more careful to pay attention who he picks up in his cab. It's dangerous. You know, and looks are deceiving. That was the case when he picked up these three guys near Boulder Highway. Clean cut, well dressed, no red flags. After taking them to two Walgreens, he was set to drop them off downtown when this happened. As soon as he hits the brakes, the man in the back seat lunges. Lucy, Lucy. Just hand on your phone and hand on the phone. Okay, okay. Give okay. us all the cash. In that moment, Dennis says he had one thought. How can I get this guy away from me? You know, how can I get out of this car and get this knife off of my neck? He gave up his cash and phone and the car and made it out alive. He dug that knife in there. He let me know it, it drew blood. He let me know there was a knife there. And I'd like to think he didn't mean business, but I, I'm pretty sure he did. But as Dennis later found out, he unknowingly became the getaway driver. The robbery at Walgreens, one of several police say the men confessed to. One of them also telling police they were strung out on drugs. Dennis's message for them? That you're idiots, you know? You're where you belong, you know? I. I'm sorry you're in the situation that you're in, but my Lord, there's other ways out of this mess. Now, the police were able to recover Dennis's cab. He's actually back at work today. Now, as for those three suspects, they're still behind bars and they're now facing several charges of robbery. Tom George, 13 Action News.